choosing instead to go by what feels right to him. That mindset might explain how Monroe once went against meaningless exhibition protocol two years ago, when he pulled a basketball away to prevent John Wall from attempting a self-pass, Ali Oak Duncan the inconsequential final seconds of the Rising Stars Challenge. Or five years ago, when Monroe was projected to be a lottery pick after his freshman year at Georgetown and elected to return for one more year despite the possible risks of injury or drop in draft stock. And, in a league that is progressively phasing out traditional big men for those who can spread the floor and shoot three-pointers, Monroe continues to be a back-to-the-basket throwback who adds more low-post moves to his arsenal. Monroe is smart enough and strong enough to do things his own way. So it shouldn't come as much of a surprise that Monroe has opted for a rather unprecedented plan to accept a one-year qualifying offer worth $5.5 million from the Detroit P.